uh, the thing I look forward to each time I go back is, is seeing the children that grew up in our home, seeing them and you know with their families, with their children, uh, going into their homes, uh, having meals with them, uh, uh, catching up with them, meeting all their families, and frankly being welcomed into their family like I am family. And, uh, uh, I feel very, very privileged, very privileged to have that experience. Um, and uh, these uh, these Bhutanese students are like children to me, and you know I think uh, I, uh, it's a very special experience to be welcomed into such an exotic culture. Um, I think there are other things that I've seen and done there. I mean, I love to hike there. Um, I love to get into wilderness areas. Uh, Bhutan is really still very unexplored, and I love pristine. Um, unexplored areas. I love the Panaka Valley. Um, I love the East now, which I've been to. Uh, and um, I, there's enormous variety in, in what can be seen and done in Bhutan. Um, and then beyond that, uh, the spiritual part of Bhutan. Uh, you can come out of a Western way of life, immerse yourself in an Eastern culture, a Buddhist culture, which places values. Uh, on pedestals, uh, which are very different from Mars, and uh, I find it a relief uh, in many ways to go there and to to be part of that culture. Sometimes my culture shock coming back home is worse than my culture shock getting there, and I think uh, that perhaps shows how much I love the country.